Alpha 3D, View and Movement. Your mouse is the primary tool for adjusting your view and models in the workspace. Right click and drag to pan the camera in any direction. Middle click and drag to move the camera around the object. Use the scroll wheel to adjust the zoom. There are two elements for controlling the view. The view preset buttons in the bottom left corner of the workspace and the view slider on the right side of the screen. Click the view preset buttons to snap the view to a specific perspective. Use the view slider to move up and down to a specific level of the model. Click the button at each end of the view slider to change the direction. The arrow adjacent to the view slider handle shows the direction in which each layer appears. You can also press the up and down arrow keys on your keyboard to move the view slider one slice at a time. You must move and rotate objects in the workspace to put them in the best position for adding supports and printing. You can adjust the orientation of an object by first selecting that object and then clicking and dragging the handles that appear around the object. The red handles rotate the object around the x-axis, green for the y-axis and blue for the z-axis. You can also use the settings and buttons in the manual orientation section on the setup panel to adjust the orientation of an object. Key in a numeric value into the text boxes to rotate the object on an axis and at a specific number of degrees. Click one of the buttons in the spinner to change the object's orientation by a fraction of a degree on that axis. Click the orientation preset buttons to snap the object into the related position. Click the select base button and then select the face of the object that you want to be parallel with the build platform. This works best with objects that have a flat base. If you do not want to print the complete object, you can use the Z position function to decrease the vertical position of the object so that the unwanted portion is below the platform. Simply set a negative value for the Z position. 